silent, making them perfect for city commuting where you want a smooth, quiet ride. Efficiency and performance. This is where things get interesting. Chain drives are more efficient at transferring power, especially with a clean and well-lubricated chain. That's why high-performance e-bikes and mountain bikes still use chains. Belt drives are slightly less efficient, but for casual riding and commuting, the difference is barely noticeable. Another key factor is gearing options. Chains work with derailleurs, giving you a wide range of gears for steep hills or high speeds. Belts require internal gear hubs or an automatic transmission, which offer a cleaner look and lower maintenance, but fewer gears. Weight and cost. Chains are cheaper and found on almost all budget e-bikes. A replacement chain costs as little as $10, while a belt drive can cost $80 or more. Belts are lighter than chains, but because they require special components like an internal gear hub or a split frame, belt drive e-bikes tend to be more expensive overall. You also can't buy these belts everywhere, and you can't readjust the tightness like on a